hello lovely and welcome back to my channel and on today's recipe we are making the crispy chicken the kfc homemade chicken so watch this video to the end as i'll be taking you straight to the ingredients right after this intro don't touch the dial welcome back so here is the finely washed potato in the pot and here is the chicken wings nicely washed with vinegar and salt as you can see it's clean so right away i'll be saving what i'll be saving the flour and just watch this as it's going so people right now i'm also trying to boil the potatoes you'll be seeing what i'll be doing with these potatoes in this recipe so here is the cartoffel meal it means potato flour so i'll be pouring that in into the ready sieved flour and i'll be adding in the curry powder just the quantity as i need it and also i'll be putting in the white pepper please check out the list of ingredients in the description box as i'll be leaving it there for you to read here also is the garlic powder and also i'll be putting that in and also the paprika powder and also i'll be putting in the chicken spice as you can see also i'm putting in the dried onions and also i'll be putting in the black pepper also the nutmeg is not left out and also i'm putting in the salt and here is the dried basil leaf which is called basilicum leaf in dutchland also i'm putting in the cameroon pepper to give it that little spicy taste here i'm just adding in the soy sauce and after putting in the soy sauce i'll be adding in the milk then i broke in egg into this recipe we all these are used to prepare the cream to do what to pour in the chicken wings into it to give it that nice and spicy taste thumbs up this video because this taste was nice so look at what i'm doing i'm just dropping in the chicken wings into this cream to do what to marinate it with it this marinates the chicken and gives it that astounding taste once it is done please share this video at this point because it is what your share and please i appreciate you to subscribe in case you're new next is the ingredient for the coating of the chicken now i just added in paprika powder into a flour and also i added in curry and i'll be adding in the black pepper also i'll be adding the chicken spice i'll also be adding in words i'll be adding in garlic powder just right measures for what you need and also the salt and then i mix all this together and at this point i'm already heating up the oil at the other point the potato has boiled up and i'm just checking the texture if it gives what i want and i said subscribe because yes it gave what i wanted and now i have saved that off and now here is the marinated chicken please i put this into the fridge for about 20 minutes and now i'll be dipping that into this cold water in the blue bowl and also into this coated flour that we've just made so check it out follow every step and i bet you will mix it so first thing i put the put the marinated chicken into the coating and now i'll be doing what dropping it into the cold water and then take it back into the coating and then into the hot pan follow everything i'm saying on the screen and i promise you you won't miss it frying this make sure the oil is hot enough before you dip in your first chicken into the hot oil so keep watching
vegetable at this point we have actually fried this chicken for about 10 to 12 minutes left and right please when frying keep stirring left and right to ensure that they all cook evenly so as you can see i'm taking it out and i'm putting it into the paper tar, as you can see and this is already looking crunchy and munchy and crispy <laughs> as you can see it's just like our kfc chicken this is the homemade type and i assure you this tastes better <laughs> For the potato, I put in the potato into the remaining cream and then I put in the coating powder that we made and then I stir that and set aside. Look at that chicken, it's very nicely fried. And now it's time to take care of the potatoes. You see what this looks like at the end of the day. Keep watching. A tip for this potato i took out the first set and see what i did i took off the remaining ashes in the part of frying and then i'll be throwing this potato back into this hot oil very hot look at what i'm saying and then i will take it out for the last time and would you know what this does it gives it that crispy hey <laughs> crispy taste that you are looking for try this potato method and i tell you irish potato will just be a goal for you everything is ready thumbs up this video this is so delicious and i know someone out there is about to see me enjoy this it's nicely served with a sauce i made out of mayonnaise and cocktail sauce cocktail sauce with mayonnaise is the cream you're seeing here so i dipped that in and i took a bite and i will also be taking the chicken and i will take a bite this was nicely fried in and out and the crispiness of it all is a go for me uh-huh yes please like this video share to friends and well wishers and also leave a resounding comment and also in case you're new subscribe turn on the notification to be among the first to be notified anytime i upload new video this is nice check it out people and i know you have enjoyed your view enjoy this with me together On this note, people, it will be a great pleasure to have your beautiful and gorgeous looking faces in the next episode of Mom Eze Kitchen and more. Remember, I love you all, but in all, God loves you more. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.